Hello everyone. I am about to attempt a do-it-yourself project and it is on the shirt. So I just got the bright idea to try to bling it out and I'm going to use the rhinestones that I got from Be to Better. These are the black ones and I have some pink ones. They are not the same shade of pink but this pink is kind of like a hot pink that um, it would take me some time to kind of find beads that would match exactly. But, and I thought, well, maybe I could do it with the glitter. I could just, you know, put some um, glue on there. And then once I put the glitter on, it'll just follow the pattern. But I don't have glitter right now. I just placed the order. For a bunch of supplies because I have a few do-it-yourself projects that I'm going to do. So until I get those supplies in, I'm just going to try and do what I can. I'm also going to use Gem Tack. Um, I looked up information about this and it looked like it's a pretty good adhesive for this job. Um, Fabric Tack, I guess, would have been my number one choice. And so I just ordered that from, I think, Joanne's Fabrics. Um, Okay, I'll be back and my shirt will be started. Okay, so what I used for this project was cardboard. A little bit of cardboard that I put in the shirt so I could have a sturdy surface to work on. So just slide um, a cardboard or book or something inside the shirt. I am almost finished with the shirt. I just have a little bit left to complete so I want to show you what um, I did. So here's my gem tack that I was putting down and this glue like all the rest of the glue pretty much dries fast. So I do a small portion at a time. So I use the needle All I do is tap it in the glue a little bit just to get a little glue on the end just a little bit and that'll help me to pick up the rhinestone. And I don't really like the the gym tag just because it's white so it's hard to see so until it dries it dries clear but until it dries sometimes you can't see which and then I just go back again and give them a little extra push down and make sure they're in the glue and secure sometimes it seems like they're just sitting on top of the glue And you want to try to keep them lined up and straight. Like I said, it looks neater. says washable after 24 hours so I'm gonna wait for 24 hours and then um, wash this to see how well the rhinestones stay on so the thing about these type of projects really is like knowing what's the best thing to use so for this one I thought about ordering hot fix rhinestones um, they have like a little tackiness on the back and you put them on with a hot tool so that would be pretty good to do for this type of project 
but I was scared that the the hot tool would burn the letters so my shirt is still drying so I don't want to put it on but I cannot wait to wear this shirt out with all the bling And here are the two shirts together so this is the shirt that I pretty much started with and this is the shirt that I've done so I think if this works out my next project I'm going to try is um, a bra So there will be pictures, but let me just give you a close-up. So this one is still drying the R. As you can see, it's starting to turn clear. And the I is still drying. <laughs> 